friends, I'm Pastor In Sale. How are you today? I'm so happy to spend this time with y'all. I have a question for you. Have you ever missed out on something? Maybe a birthday party you couldn't go to or a soccer game you couldn't play because you were out of town. Well, this question reminds me of something that I um, would uh, quite a lot miss when I was in your age. So I'd be with a bunch of people and I would be thinking about um, something and while everyone would be talking and then everyone would laugh. So I was so curious, but because of I was not paying attention, I couldn't know why they were laughing. So I would ask someone, hey, what happened? Why are you laughing so much? But they would be laughing too much and to tell me. So I would feel very upset, but it was my fault. I was not paying attention. So likewise, there is one Bible story and there is a pretty much the same thing happened to the, the one of the disciples um, of Jesus. Well, Jesus had told the disciples to stay together after he was crucified. So that is what the most of the disciples did. They stayed together. But one of Jesus' disciples, Thomas, did not do listen. So Thomas did not stay together with the other disciples. So when Jesus showed up to the other disciples, Thomas totally missed seeing resurrected Jesus. And when he found out what he missed, he said to the other disciples, I don't believe you. I don't believe that you saw the resurrected Jesus. But guess what? He learned something from his mistake. After his mistake, he decided to pay better attention to what Jesus told him to do. So Thomas stayed with the other disciples again. And then he had a second chance and so resurrected Jesus. It is pretty cool, right? So the same thing that was true for Thomas is the same true for us. We too are invited to follow Jesus together. And we too are invited to learn what Jesus taught together. And then should we forget or let our attention wander, we are given second chance to learn about and uh, get to know more about Jesus. And this is the good news for today. So everyone, let us try to pay attention what Jesus is telling us today. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for giving us a chance to know about you. Help us to remember and help us to learn about you. We love you and we thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.